it was never really an ambition of mine to model like to be honest I never thought I could I, I didn't really I wasn't that self-confident at that age and a, a friend of mine at school um, saw an advert in a, in a teen magazine for a modeling competition it was a road show being held in Glasgow and uh, it was during the October holidays at school and she kind of persuaded me to go down and we did this day trip and um, and I think even I think I hadn't even entered it yet and suddenly this woman came rushing up to me and was like hello <laughs> you know are you, are you interested in modeling and and here I am that was it and that yeah that was kind of almost six years ago which is crazy but um, I think because I've always done performing on a certain level it did feel quite natural I felt quite at home on sets and and shoots and I never really felt kind of out of my comfort zone but it, definitely being in London and also beginning to travel was really really exciting I think with acting it incorporates a bit more because with acting you, you think about your accent your voice your body language uh, but definitely in modeling you you do take on roles in terms of how you hold yourself or how you move in front of the camera and I think even if you just go to a basic level certain clothes or certain looks do make you feel different. You know, I think as a woman, if you put on a corset or a, or a kind of corseted dress, you, you automatically bring yourself up and hold yourself in a slightly different way than you would if you were just normal. And I think wigs do it as well, I definitely think. If, you know, if you have a cropped wig like we did in The Hunger Shoot, I felt like a completely different person. My mum has something ridiculous like three grade eights. <laughs> uh, she did piano, organ and singing. So the piano and the singing definitely came from her and um, my dad also used to be a folk singer in France when he was in his early 20s and I've I actually got one of his posters up in my apartment. Um, and the film I just finished I, I actually played piano in. So luckily actually with a lot of my favourite jobs I've done so far I've managed to incorporate music into them. So I think I've been very lucky like that, I've kept it up, yeah.